So, this is my first Cosmic video, and I mean the first I'm recording in hardware installation, and, um, basically this is my very first day I'm actually using Cosmic. Whoa. You know, trying Cosmic on a virtual box, and really really using it on your PC, it's nothing alike. And I have so much more to say than the last time. But for now, let me share you a stupid workflow I discovered, or should I say, a stupid workflow I invented. Enough. Let's do this. And as always in Linux, everything starts with a terminal. Most specifically, the Cosmic terminal that I've built from sources, and it has a very nice feature. Which still makes me wonder why GNOME doesn't put it to their terminals. So we can split the terminal horizontally and vertically. Meanwhile, the subtle pane selections, together with the hover resize bars, make it super beautiful. There's nothing comparable to the plasma console abomination. Especially if we disable the header bars, the window reaches levels of awesomeness you didn't even think were possible. But everything simply gets ruined the moment we open our first tab. You may not realize it right away, but the tab doesn't connect to the application window. Instead, it is attached to the panes. So these tabs here are tabs of this pane. If I open a tab here, you'll better understand what's happening. I have no clue why someone would implement such a system, other than it was harder to make proper tabs that own split views. So, that's perhaps a temporary solution? Whatever. Let me show you a workaround I discovered to overcome the stupid tab system. Um, I will enable the header bar for now. And create a new window. I'm not sure why I'm using the menus or why they even exist on a terminal app, but they work okay for some strange reason. Anyway, super and S for creating a stack, okay? And from the right and left edges, we can grab it and move it. Now we can grab our second window and place it carefully over the header of the stack until we see the stack windows signal. Basically, this is a very nice implementation that works for both floating and tiled windows. Um, let me disable the header again. No need that anymore. So, now on this tab, I have regular split terminals. See? And on that one, I don't. How smart am I, huh? Don't give me an exact number. Just say, super smart, normal smart, dumb as hell, what you think. Um, another thing is, with the stack selected, if we open a new window, for example, a new terminal, that will be added to the stack. That actually will work for anything, so we can also add to our stack an Alacrity terminal. Like that. So here runs Alacrity, but here's a cosmic tab, a pro way to mess up. But we can grab it from the tab bar and throw it out. So that was everything. Um, would I switch from GNOME to Cosmic? Oh, well, there are a couple of issues. First, there is the matter of the actual issues. Because currently, Cosmic is unusable. Not because of the lack of features, but because of the bugs. Literary? They beat KDE 3 in their very first release hands down. My other big concern is the miss of an overview. Very usually, I need to drag and drop stuff from one workspace to another. And on Cosmic, I can't even drag and drop stuff between apps on the very same workspace. Eventually, though, who doesn't want to switch to a Rust desktop? Even start learning Rust there? No BS, that alone is very tempting. Oh, and also? The Wayland compositor of Cosmic, it works already better than the Wayland compositor of GNOME. At least to me. So we'll see. Bye bye. Me out.